Hey YouTube, uh, sorry I haven't been on uh, making videos lately a lot. I've been very, very stupid busy trying to uh, catch up on everything. Um, I'm going to try not to be all over the place with this video because that's what I do with every single video. But uh, first things first is uh, today we finished that large brush job at like... 11:50 a.m. or like noon roughly right around there either way we finished it and it was very very relieving to finish it like the, the customer might still want us to do some stuff on the ground because it's pretty muddy and it, he wants it to be mowed and everything but like the trees and everything we cut down the trees that took a couple of days and then just the hauling away part took even like probably longer than that let me think here our job took roughly four days the vast majority of it was hauling it away because of how far I had to haul it unfortunately but whatever still charged for it um so that'll be a nice uh a nice check to see when I do see it um so the brush job and then um yeah, when I see the big fat check, I'm going to just be stingy and put that into my business account and just not touch it unless I literally have to. Or if it's to pay me for working for my business. That's it. Uh, but other than that, I want to be really stingy and in the uh, fall time or even in the summertime if I'm able to, I want to pre-order some type of salter hook onto the back of my truck because I have one customer in specific that has three driveways that I do for her and one is very long or at least when you're walking it and throwing the salt non-stop it's a long driveway trust me uh, so I really want to get a salter so that I can just use a salter instead of walking the driveway and throwing it non-stop not throwing it tossing it so yeah, the brush job, the salter, um, we just did a job today, I sent two guys over to a job, a mowing and slash spring cleanup type of job, and I got their customer paid me, and they were like, the person was like, you, you have a very good crew, you know, you guys did a great job, and I was, I was happy to hear that my guys did a good job. <clears throat> and then, so custom, that customer was happy uh, gave me the check right then and there um, I want to make sure I'm not forgetting anything here huge brush job uh, salter I'm also like I said not trying to be all over the place huge brush job salter um, right now I'm going to look at a job that's like roughly 40 minutes away and then I also have another person that's kind of a recurring customer because they they want me to give them an estimate on stump removing and uh, I think it was brush cutting or something like that so there's those uh, I also wanted to kind of uh, respond a little bit to the criticism. I'm not, I'm not going to point any of them out in specific. I'm not going to go on about them. I just want to simply say that there was roughly, out of all the work I've been doing for people the past month or so, there's only been one, two, three all together that were unhappy. And one of them, I like almost never do work for. I I plowed their driveway one time in the wintertime for them. The other one was the one where I offered the dude mulch for free because I don't want him to be too upset, and then he never responded. Lesson learned. Uh, and then the other one was the mowing job where my weed whip was down, and I made sure that I bought another a uh, a still steel still however you pronounce it a still uh weed whip 
we use that now and then we also have two other ones and I just need to make sure that those ones are up to date and ready to go. Um, this video is getting kind of long. But uh, I just want to um, kind of uh, <clears throat> say that for the most part, and I by that I mean like 90, 95 to 98% of the time, I'm, I'm not getting that with customers. Like they're not unhappy with me because literally every time that I think I am done with a job, I will go to the customer and I will say, hey, take a walk around with me. I want to make sure that you are happy with the job. And if there's anything I missed or anything extra you want done, please let me know. And on top of that, you also have to, uh, if your customer already knows you and they trust you and you already know your customer and you trust them, bingo, bro. Um, don't ever screw that one up because that will be ugly. Uh, um, I would say 95% of the customers that I have trust me and I trust them. And by trust, I mean they trust that you're going to do a good job, but you still make sure that they walk around with you to make sure that they are happy. And you, the person who is providing the work, is trusting if you don't have a contract signed, you are trusting that the person will pay you. See, I used to go on about how you need to sign a contract no matter what. When you're on a job and you don't know how long it's going to take, it's kind of hard to do that. I simply just tell people, this is what I charge per hour. But again, if, if, if it's like, if it's a new person that you don't know, absolutely sign a contract and just say it will not go over this total amount. That way you know for a fact you're going to get your money. But... <clears throat> You definitely need that uh, customer relationship where, uh, again, they trust you and you trust them. Um, so, yeah, there was that. And, um, what was I going to say? I already forgot. Oh, yeah, the people were, there was quite a, a decent amount of people that were commenting and saying that I was bad and not doing great and that I shouldn't own business, blah, blah, blah. That's what the whole point was, is that uh, for the most part, my customers are happy with me. And that's because I try my best to make sure that they are happy with the work that I do. That being said, I'm glad for the, uh, I'm glad for all the criticism. That's good. I need, everyone needs constructive criticism so that they can get better. Uh, there was a specific YouTuber who commented, he commented a longer paragraph, but his by far was definitely the best advice out of any of the other ones. But yeah, I'm sick. I've been working sick for the past three days now. It's shitty. I don't care. I need money. <clears throat> so anyway, this is getting on to be a, quite a long video. So yeah, brush job, uh, salter, uh, customer uh, satisfaction slash relationship, uh, and then replying to the criticism. Um, yeah, if I don't res if I don't make another video soon, it'll be uh, because again I'm too busy. Uh, I'm gonna be. Tomorrow I'm going to be mowing everything that needs mowed, and then if somebody calls for another job, which I wouldn't be surprised if they did, I'll go look at that job, uh, but I still have to go look at this mowing job, and I still have to go look at another job over there. Uh, so yeah, this is getting to be a pretty long video. Uh, I hope you all know that I'm all for peace and love. I'm always unfiltered and uncensored. And I hope you all like and subscribe. Thank you for 51 subscribers. Uh, and don't forget, my nickname is Biggs. Biggs out.